Hey, so this is going to be the final part of my Universal DVD collection. This might be the final part, but if we can't make it, if there's a part four, I'm sure it'll be the last part, but we'll see how we do here. But last left off in part two, I showed you guys Lossy Translation, and now it's time to start part three of my Universal DVD collection. So, here we go. There is an on this DVD, but it's now mine. So no, no need to return this DVD to him. This next DVD, um, I know it does not have the Universal logo shown anywhere, but uh, the opening of this DVD, the Universal logo is shown because um, this is from Mercury, a Universal music company. So, 
why don't I go ahead and show it off since it's from Mercury, a universal music company. Here it is. This concert was from 1981. I have the um, CD album of this. I have those albums except for the the debut album, Fly By Night, all the, um, not all the words. I have all these albums except for the debut album, Fly By Night, Archives, and Hemispheres. I have the other ones, though. This is a former rental from a uh, top 40 video. <laughs> it's pretty interesting. Hold on. Compared to that, look at that. <laughs> I showed these both side by side. <laughs> interesting how I was able to do that. <laughs> so cool. Case might look a little bit faded, but the DVD still works.
I've had this DVD for a very long time. I've had this DVD since 2011, I think. Alright, I'm going to go and show one last DVD for this part, and then we'll stop. I knew we had to make a part four, but that's alright. Uh, that's going to be it for part 3 of my Universal DVD collection. See you guys in part 4, which will be the last part, so stick around.